The Chinese has uh, said that they are going to ban all wet markets for wildlife animals in China. Um, they said that this is a permanent ban. Um, the last time that they put restrictions on these wet markets uh, with all these wildlife animals was in 2008 when there was a SARS outbreak. But shortly after, they removed the ban. Um, and hopefully it's going to stick today. I mean, for me, it's terrible, obviously, this disease and killing humans, but it's more, it's not more so. It's unthinkable what they do to these animals. I just wish that I was stronger, but it's so painful to like even think about this stuff. But I've made a commitment to myself that I'm going to not just sit here and feel bad for animals and, you know, kind of push down the animal activist that's been in me since I was a young child. Um, I'm going to actually take action and try and make a difference. Um, so we'll see what happens with the wet markets, but I think that in addition to diseases, us as humans just really need to take a little bit of a step back and think about, you know, the meat that we're eating. Um, well, I don't eat meat. I haven't since I was eight, but...